Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Full Stack Adda. In today's video, we are going to learn JavaScript class enhancements. First one, we can declare variables outside class constructor. And second one, private variables and private methods, how to declare and access them. And third one, about the static block. Let me show you these three new features with an examples first i'm going to show you how we can declare variables outside the constructor so before es13 feature we used to declare the variables inside the constructor like this and we have we can access these public variables outside the class by just with the reference variable of that particular class object now same variables we can declare outside the constructor but uh, within the same within the class like this so first name and last name we can declare here if you want we can also initialize these variables with some default values and for this example i'm creating the object new person with the reference variable person obj by default these variables are public so we can access them outside the class as well and we can assign data like this i'm just uh, printing here let me run this class go to the run run without debugging now we will get in the first uh, log narayana and second log last name narayana Bajja so we can also declare this another parameters to this constructor and within this constructor we can assign data to these variables that also we can do so this is how we can declare variables outside the constructor and another feature declaring private variables and private methods so to make a variable as a private we need to append hash before that variable name like this you can see hash to the first name variable and i just declared i just assigned the value in this in the same line only and last name this is also private variable and for methods same we need to append hash before that method name and this get first name it returns the first name private variable so when we are accessing that private variable also we need to have this hash symbol this dot hash and that variable name and same here we have another private method hash get last name and here also same to access that uh, uh, last name private variable we can do like this dot hash symbol and last name and here get full name it doesn't have a symbol so it's a public method and this method internally calls those two private methods and returns the, the concatenation of those two written values and outside of the class i'm creating object for this one and if we try to access that private variable let me run this one We get the error see we have got the syntax error private field hash first name must be declared in an enclosing class so we cannot access private variables outside the class now public this pub we have one public method get full name we can access it let me run this example run without debugging yeah we have got the full name so this is how we can declare private variables and private methods now last example about the static block same i have taken person class and here i have declared a static variable with the keyword static and this is the static block added in es13 so we first write the keyword static and open curly brace and close curly brace this entire section represents one block which is a static block 
and within this static block I am just assigning data to name static variable and I also declared get name method it is also a static method because I have added static keyword in method declaration so for this class I have create so we no need to create object for this class because we just have one static method this static method we can access with the help of class name so class name is person and method name get name it returns the full name and in the console I'm printing it let me run this class run run without debugging Yeah, so here I have assigned Narayana so we can see same value in the console so these are all the three new enhancements added as a part of ES13 for a JavaScript class I hope you have learned something new remaining features we can learn in the upcoming video and I will also add this uh, sample examples to my uh, github project and will add in the comments thanks for watching bye